Hello everyone, Alfred Monty here, and today we're going to be doing a few things. The spire down here, I would like to create a few pig houses for a little bit of a farm we're going to create later on. And I'd also like to dig up some grass tufts for also another type of farm for later. Now when it's more obvious, I would like to create a grass farm. So let me think here. Also, we made a fridge already. We have silk. We need to make bird traps. At least I believe we need to make bird traps. And this is for bird catching. Do we have seeds in here? Urchin seeds, I'll let's eat these real quick before they go bad. Yeah, so we have two, two cooked meat in there. Uh, we don't really have any large grass fields. Oh, that's a lion alarm going in there. We don't have any large grass fields, so let's go find some fields. Oh, seeds, perfect. So we will just that and do a few, few things today. Do I have my shovel? I do have my shovel. So my goal is to dig up as much grass and sticks as possible. Also since I am slightly older Wanda, I'd like to get some food. I'm okay with getting a little older because I'll make this farming a little bit easier. Because I am old Lady Wanda, I will deal a lot more damage. Okay, so just need to recollect all my sticks. So now you see why I wanted my least valuable resources on the left hand side. Alright, let's go do a quick bit of collecting here. That'll be very useful. So now I'm reminded that I don't have that great of a source of healing at this point so it might be best to explore the caves sooner rather than later we'll cross that bridge when we get to it 
see. More frogs here. Maybe. Let's do some quick refueling. Also, the range that the alarming clock gives is incredibly helpful. green mushroom over here shown on the map oh it's day 11 in that case i need to go towards Kulam. Ooh, gunpowder quick rocks yeah and go get glomer that'll be very useful long term because of the bomber goop Bomber Goop, if you do not know, it is very important for large amounts of sanity loss. Which that's just going to be very handy. Also, I need to be a little bit more careful than I normally am, since I do not have my football helmets. in here. Um, we're probably not going to fight the pigs. We don't want to risk Glomer, especially with the... I guess we can tell the cat coon. The meat's nice, no problem there. Target. Stop doing that because you're in campus. We'll 
we'll stay around here for a hot minute. Use the rest of that nightmare fuel for the man. We got one pick skin. Let it go. The hound's too there. Just leave that. You don't want to fight any shadow creatures until I have armor. <sighs> really wanted to kill those were pigs, but with the amount of chasing me, I just couldn't afford to get hit there because I would actively lose everything. I didn't think they'd be that quick on their feet. Okay. Then we're gonna need to come back at some point for cut reeds so that we can make paper for the bird cage. Because I believe we have enough gold. We should have more than enough gold at this point. We have definitely more than 20. Do not need to kill more frogs. We're okay with not dealing with that right now. Okay. Now we got a bird for the bird cage. Yeah. Now we store you. Then I'm gonna the frog lakes now. Then Glomer. Go place you here for now. So the reason why I'm cooking them is that meat items do last longer when cooked, generally speaking. And a lot of like fruits and a lot of vegetables like carrots, berries, etc. They uh, last longer when they're uncooked. Like you saw the cooked berries earlier. Uh, they were decaying very, very quickly. At times like these I wish I was Walter or something like that so I could cook a little faster. You know what? We gotta do what we gotta do here. Sapling here already, so we'll just plant a few here. There are inventory. Not pretty, but you know what? It'll do for now. Now for let's see, put you in the fridge. Those green mushrooms will be good for some active sandy loss for later on. Then I could just make let's see, I need four pig skin for Take houses. Have five. Used one. We do not need it. Let's put that in there. And I think. I would really like to make a 
a mushroom farm. Now I thought about it, you also can lose city from uncooked frog legs. I did not consider that. But don't do it. Our chests are back there. Okay. Which is okay. I save some grass with that rope, but Keep getting younger, get our health back. Um, we'll get our bird as well, because I don't know how long it'll be till we get the bird cage rolling. We have all well, less than eight days to prepare for winter. We have plenty of rocks, we have plenty of materials and resources to get winter going well, so I think I'm happy enough with how things are going. I would like to find some beefalo though, because I'd like to kill a beefalo for the beefalo horns for the beefalo hat, is what I would like. And with that in mind, Beefalo Bell might not be a bad idea for when I encounter that situation. Some food with me. There we go, go get some cut reeds. And hopefully find a solid beefalo location. But first things first, cut reeds. For the bird cage. Okay. Oh, it's so. Bring the microphone closer to me. I don't know if you guys could hear me clearly that whole time, but uh, I kind of can't load back to a previous, I guess I could do a server rollback to before I started the video, but oh, we're just gonna roll with it. Okay. Now, straight up, just straight up it looks like, yeah. Okay. And more pig houses up here. Hold I'll tear those down the way back since I do have my hammer. I still have that little pig farm. Not pig farm. Uh, little spider farm idea that I want to do. Because if we have so some automation going. Oh, what the heck? I'm feeling a little jumpy right now that. Not crawling forward. The terror beak. Over there, startled me. I remember. 
always running out of time. Those, those are always nice for the pig skins. Patch here. Uh. And I believe I need two paper, but I'll probably need more paper for shadow armor. Smack there. Okay. So I go up a little bit. Just follow the path and hopefully that takes us to where we need to be. Looks like we're making way back to that moon altar it looks like I found a straight path there okay. um not actively not fight the rooms right now my sanity too because at any moment I could just be fighting shadow creatures alongside these merms. in the swamps. So the desert entrance does not appear to be on this side. So probably in another section then. Yeah, okay, do not want to get pricked by the mosquitoes there. I'd like to get out of here before nightfall out of here before night time would be great so I don't have to worry about tentacles, merms, etc. Oh, just got me there. On the bright side, the horrors of the swamp are very much surface level. Which I'm totally okay with there. Much, much safer. We came out with a, a lot of, well, enough resources. I wouldn't say a lot, but enough. You 
would like a more reliable area for grass. I'll be fighting shadow creatures in a second here, so hold up. let's actually fight one that I know is around. Buys me a lot of sanity from that. Good things, good things. Alright. So we will make that bird cage. That we can do some egg creation going. So the whole purpose well there's a few purposes for eggs. Eggs are needed for pierogies, which are the highest health gain food in the game. But uh, I do not need to care about that on my end since I cannot heal traditionally. So the main appeal for eggs would be food renewability. And what I mean by that is food degrades over time. You can give food to birds in order to refresh it in a sense. If you give them like vegetables, uh, it will just produce the same type of seed. If you give them a carrot, you'll get carrot seed. If you get a uh, tomato, you get tomato seed. So in that sense, it's not that useful. But if you give them meats, they will produce eggs. Which is very much important. Happy I saved enough seeds here. Because I always forget seeds for the birdcage. Okay. I want the bird cage for now. I want the grass to have to be down there. Chests are there. So I'll just keep the bird cage out of the way here. Let's put our bird cage here. Okay. Just to demonstrate, we'll grab like a meat item. Let's grab meat. Just to show. Can you meat? What do you give us? Give us eggs. Our first egg. And then, yeah. So we have a way to produce eggs. And Picking also collects eggs and turns them to gold as well. I do see. A suspicious dirt pile here. That goes, that goes over here. I'm gonna follow that. Oh, hold up. I mean, we gotta get the name of Sita. Like this way? Difficult to tell because it was over top. it one more time. We're not that far. It has to be this way. It's fine, that was an unfortunate placement there. We'll get it next time. Now... I would like to start a bee farm at some point. I also want to get started on... A few other plans. Let's see, like that. The pick skins. Then. Start crafting. And. We have that to start.
sorry, dude. Oh. I let you hit me. This could be a headache now. Sorry, dude. Had to be done. I'm just going to set this up. I can take this up too. Yeah. Well, I feel like we're going to be pretty decent on sticks, at least for now. I don't think I can pick that up, but that's okay. Now I don't want to pick flowers. I'm okay with my sanity where it is. I'll think about that for a second. And also, we can give the bird monster meats or eggs as well. Still enough logs. I'm gonna start the fire now because I want to be cooking. I'm going to pre-craft this. Go on up here. Now, younger. Get the cut reeds in there. Meat. I got so spider glands and more silk. Still have the nightmare fuel for the alarm clock. Now we can pick up the eggs. I feel like we're doing good. I feel like we're making some decent progress. Ah, hold up. The rest of the meat. Now let's look here real quick. Okay, so there could potentially be more stuff going on up north. Thinking, what do I want to do at this point? I think I would like. Let's see, Mag Tusk is there. Need grass. That's really the main thing. We need. However, we'd get started with this too. Okay, do you offer? Yeah, I might not even cut that. That was pretty darn quick. Did you see I have a little indicator up there? Uh, that is a mod for the various underground phases. Right now it's phased on, so nothing to really think about right now. Alright. 
Normal spiders. There are grass tufts that would be very nice to see. Oh wait, there are. I'm gonna keep the light going on my headpiece for now until I get closer to the middle here. Okay, cool. Because it is daytime. But even though it's daytime, it's important to note that sanity loss is still very much real down here. Because it is consistent, it is constant, so they'll have to be very much aware of that. I don't want to take more sticks right now. I do, however, I keep getting thinner. Uh, looks like a separate entrance. Okay, pretty close together, but that's fine. I do need to fertilize these. I believe I do have rot that can fertilize at least a little bit of what I have in terms of grass. See, light bulbs also turn into rot pretty quickly too. Very, very important to note that. If that is the case, I could be wrong. It just evaporates, but I'm pretty sure it turns to rot. Same with petals, I think. Could be a path up north or more southeast. What I'm seeing. It looks like I do have an unlockable next time I am at a science station. So that'll be good to see you there. This is a uh, just dead end. It's not. It goes somewhere. This keeps branching. Okay. I have no problems with that. I think we'll go until we have 20 grass tufts. Sticks right now, this very second. That's right here. Okay. We'll go walk around this. There's a lot of spiders down here, which is good. That's a whole spider biome. Good note. Feels like there should be another entrance over here too, simply because of all the starting resources. Oh, it looks like I'm correct. Okay. 
So now I'm thinking that everything that's northish just kind of a starter area in a sense what I can tell if we have a underground we have a few underground ponds here but nothing exciting is there anything exciting up here that I can tell hmm no doesn't seem like it although there's a big gap Ooh, okay. We have more of something here. There's always a little more than whatever I'm expecting whenever I'm exploring the caves. So I would really, really like to find um, the ruins. Are the ar archives for some thulacite. Thulacite is one of the main crafting components that Wanda desperately needs in order to progress her gameplay. It's very, very important so that I can get more of these angel swatches. Because the more consistently I can recover HP, the better, I think, anyway. So it looks like there should be a path on this side here. Uh, these entrances are just all right next to each other. It's kind of wild. I want to see where this goes then. Give that a quick glance. All these loading screens I'm going to be removing. Um. Okay, we're very much northwest, okay. We'll explore this section real quick while the bats are chasing me. There's some lobsters there. Yeah. Might as well check on this segment here just to see if there's anything worth exploring. Got a gobbler. Okay. Large amount of moles here. Large amount of moles. So we have a Here's not too useful, I guess. Just a bunch of moles in another frog area that's already that's already super close to camp. Okay, right, that's fine. Um, five days to winter. Yeah, let's just walk back to camp. As per the normal process. I'm gonna want these light bulbs to rot. This is not gonna be too impactful at this point for the winter because the grass won't grow back that much. However, the hmm. 
Mm. I heard the spiders yelling, but eh, nothing I need to think about. Yeah. We're back. We're gonna store that. Start planting these grass tufts. So now, before I plant the grass tufts, I would like to paint a pen, I think. The reason why is because I know if there's enough grass in an area, you can spawn grass geckos. What do I need for a fence? Need a rope. Okay. Let's see, there's a rope somewhere in Chester. But I think we're gonna do the ash picket fence. Oh, you also need sticks! Silly me! to make a gate. This is not going to be perfect, by the way. That's fine. We'll need to make a gate. See, this is those times where I wish I had that one placement mod. Screen for a second there. You know what? Let's see. Please. Controller, why are you betraying me? When he's fine, come on. There we go. Okay. Now we need to fertilize. for a moment. The sticks are growing at least. And then you have the rot, right Chester? You.
Oh, nope. I don't want to eat that. Game! Chester, that on, Throw that, that up, Throw that too. And eat. Can't fit. That's fine. That's gonna. Probably have to be fine. This for now. Okay. Okay. I don't want sneakers. I have too many sneakers. Right? Okay. I'll put zero out there. And then, do I have any pigskin left? I don't think I do, but let's see. Quick check. Don't, okay. So now. May want to do is just pick skin by the walrus camp there. Still haven't found a large grass field, although I'm suspecting it's probably southwest in this section here. So that's what I'm gonna check. And Seattle still not really that big of a problem yet. Will be at some point, but just not right now. Okay. Should pick up the meat from those traps, but pretty much all I use the traps for the pressed hat later, so. I don't really give it too much less. Uh, please don't just be a B area. Mm. Well, it doesn't look like it's necessarily the B area yet. Oh wait, hold on. Oh yeah, oh, yeah that's B area. <laughs> Grasslands down here. That we can see. Lumpy tree forest. Oh, there's still more road here. Okay. 
Sperm hole. Okay. Sperm hole's fine. Wait, what? I'm gonna drink there. I'm not gonna pick that, but I'm just gonna take a mental note that we have one there. Okay. Spiders. What's that there? Oh, just pig. I'll take your house. You're so far out of the way that this pig house would never impact me anyway. That's oh, actually a normal rock biome there. way to access that. There it is! Oh, more grass geckos! There's still more here. Okay, okay. Okay, quick walk. What do we find? If this is a strip of rocks, I'm not going to complain, especially with the grass geckos here. Flint? Okay. What's up, dude? This should be a lot more clear where I'm supposed to go in the desert. Yeah. Yeah. Koala fan would be great. A mucus, I will avoid. Outright. If you guys don't know what a mucus is, uh, we'll talk about that if it is one. Because single player, the mucus is terrible to deal with. Just to qualify it though. But we're gonna try and trap it if we can. Qualifant tusk, so we can make ourselves a winter vest. We also got a ton of meat. I'm excited about that. Okay. Just 
still want to go through that wormhole though. That'll make me insane. Four days left. We got Qualifant Tusk. We're okay with making a winter vest. No problems there. Looks like there's another sort of desert here. Nah, desert! Yo, we finally found him, dude. wise to take that damage but you know what I don't really care I'm happy here either dang it man I really really would like that horn if I can help it then hold up I think I can eat here anything I can part with Just no wool, man. No, no horn. Why? Darn, dude. That's fine. It's gonna have to be fine. Let's just go. Oh, oh yeah, one of the useless wormholes. Okay. 
days left. The trees are starting to... Okay. Hmm. Wand is 36. So what I should be doing at this point is probably making drying racks. Okay. Also take note of that spider nest because spider queens are definitely in the realm of possibility. Any bats nearby? Doesn't look like it. Okay. So let's see. Where is the charcoal? You have the charcoal? No. I feel like I did have charcoal. Wait, yes, we do. So. Thinking. I like the idea of drying racks more than charcoal at this point. More than crock pots. can I realistically make? Is this the axe I dropped? Yeah. Okay, yeah, what's the price for drying max? Cooking, that makes sense. We'll make the class for this. Just to move out of the way. Left with no grass again, right? Pretty much, yeah. That's alright. Eggs. What do I get if I do cook them? Because it showed 10 there. Well, I'll better cook them, yeah. Put up some space. We'll queue those up to the next drying rack. And Battleisk wings. I don't know if I care about that. But this should just spoil at this point in time. 
Drop that. Should probably stomach a crockpot at some point for sanity based foods. I don't need to worry about that yet. Sooner rather than later, but not yet. Okay. Glad I saved that pickaxe, because I will need to be making a stone. More specifically, a thermal stone. Days left. Now in terms of winter equipment. Gonna need to learn how to get along without. Still don't have a beefalo horn, so. Eat eight silk. How much, how much silk do I have? Five. Eight. Okay. Let's get up here and gather some quick silk for some winter gear. stuff up on the way back. in there. Okay. Yeah. So we definitely have enough silk now. Make the vest. Happy about that. Which means... I have to give up the backpack for a little while. Okay. It's okay. Less organizing, at least. Okay. That's. Mm. Important. Tire will organize like this. I'm gonna stop digging stuff for now, so do not need that shovel. But we'll probably need an axe. But I don't think I'll need too much gold right now, so I'll leave that here. We'll always need nightmare fuel. 100% we'll always need nightmare fuel. I think if I need flint, I don't think so. I think I can leave the hammer here too, honestly. That shouldn't be a problem. Wood is wood. Potential issue, I don't think it is. These. Living logs.
I'll grab the shovel real quick. Pick up these stumps to make camp look a little cleaner. Are they, are they attacking Chester? That's fine, I guess. Okay. I'll leave the Glomer Goop there. Okay. I'll chop to this tree here. Still, Living Log is a potential thing we could be looking at, but still doubt it. Yeah. I'm getting grass. No problems at all. Okay. Is there anything else we can do at this point before winter? Let's see, I need to carry that around now. Get a little younger. Quick fueling. We're covered on food. We're covered on uh, resources right now. A little low on grass, but otherwise we're fine. I guess next time we'll be doing a little bit of base building. Oh, let's see. Back to base. Okay. So next time we'll be working a lot more with winter. Because I think two days till winter. Once night goes through, it'll be one night. And then... We'll be dealing with a lot of winter shenanigans. So, dealing with a lot more penguins and deer clops. So, that'll be exciting to have to play through. So, everyone, thank you so much for watching. Please leave a like and comment down below if you want to see more content like this. If you like what I'm doing, please subscribe and hit the bell for all things Alfred Monty. Thank you. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.